A founder of the fashion brand The Couples has been accused of wearing blackface, according to a report from the Daily Mail. In a story published on Friday, the outlet posted photos showing Laurent Elijah, one of the founders of the French fashion label, and his wife Nomi wearing dark brown paint on their faces. In the images, which were allegedly posted on Nomi's Instagram account, the duo also wore fake dreadlocks as well as tribal makeup and jewelry. Nomi's account is now set to private. Get push notifications with news, features and more. Follow following you'll get the latest updates on this topic in your browser notifications. According to the outlet, Laurent and Nomi, as well as their two young children, were dressed up for the Jewish holiday of Purim which was celebrated Wednesday and Thursday of this week. In one screenshot allegedly from Nomi's Instagram story, she captioned a selfie of her costume number Tribalvab. Another caption read, When I said I fell in love with Africa. The Daily Mail reported that Instagram users commented on the images to accuse the family of wearing blackface. The Couples did not immediately respond to people's request for comment, but the Daily Mail reported that Nomi removed the photos and apologized in a statement, saying that she regrets and apologizes for any offense that has been caused. The Couples is a French fashion label founded by Laurent and his brothers Alexander and Raphael Alicia. The company has worked with many celebrities, including Irina Shaykh and Zayn Malik. On Wednesday, the business of fashion reported that the owner of fashion brand Lacoste was in talks to buy the brand. The outlet reported that Swiss investor Mose Frears, which owns Lacoste along with other brands, is said to have begun exclusive negotiations with shareholders of the Couples. The company did not immediately respond to people's request for comment. The Couples isn't the first fashion brand to come under for fire for blackface in recent months. In February, Gucci faced intense backlash over an $890 sweater that sparked accusations of racism for resembling blackface. Gucci says we accept full accountability after blackface uproar, vows to step up diversity hiring Gucci has since apologized for the sweater. In a statement on February 15, Gucci president and CEO Marco Bazzari said the brand would accept full accountability for this incident and announced plans to step up diversity hiring 